Hey guys, ECRG here, back with another episode. The title of today's episode, we're going to be talking about should this person get a nursing degree or a biology degree if they're interested in pursuing a career in clinical research. So we'll go ahead and get into that. But first, I want to let you guys know about the resume review program, career consultation, and interview preparation. So we offer all of these services. If you're interested in that, email me, eliteclinicalgroup at gmail.com. If you want more uh, dedicated feedback to your current situation, I recommend you book a career consultation call. We have 15 minutes, 30 minutes, and an hour. So book one of those calls, and you'll be sure to get your question answered for, the, for your situation. It's a lot harder to do that via email. Um, so, you know, if it's a quick question, I can answer via email. Otherwise, I'm going to encourage you to book a, a small 15-minute or 30-minute session. So let's go ahead and get into this. So this person emailed in. They said, hi, I've been watching your videos on clinical research, and they have been extremely helpful. Thank you so much for the support. The information isn't always super easy to come by, so thank you for the content you provide. I do have a specific question that I was hoping you might be able to provide some insight into. I'm halfway through my BSN slash nursing degree, and I'm wondering if having a nursing background is helpful for a career in clinical research. I know nurses are utilized, but is this credential sought after slash desirable? Would it be more advantageous or provide more career options if this in this industry to have a BSN versus a life science degree like biology? Thanks for your help. All right, guys. So nursing degree versus biology degree, which one will be more beneficial to you in a clinical research career? So this is twofold. So the first thing you want to consider is what are you going to be doing right after you get this degree? Okay. So is your idea to get a nursing degree and then go immediately into clinical research or get a biology degree and go immediately into clinical research? Because in that regard, I'm assuming that a nursing degree does have some basic biology courses and basic science courses in there. Um, so they're, they're kind of similar. They're both science-y related. Um, so I would say they're pretty much equal in that regard. Um, you know, maybe a biology degree would be a little bit better because they're like, why did you do a nursing background and um, decide to go into clinical research? Um, so maybe uh, biology would be better in that regard. But um, where the nursing degree really, really shines is if you take that nursing degree, go be a nurse for a year or two, and then take that to be a clinical study coordinator. Or you can do it for even less for all that matter. You can do that for six months. And then go take that to be a study coordinator. Now, that is where your nursing background and skills are very, very beneficial. And I would pick nursing over biology. So just to recap real quick, because that may have been confusing. If you're not going to go work afterwards, um, you're going to go right into clinical research, I would choose biology. If you are planning to work as a nurse for a little bit, just because you want that experience, then I would definitely go nursing degree. Uh, because that's going to be, that is definitely sought after in clinical research as a study coordinator, because they want people that can take phlebotomy. They want people that are familiar with patients. They want people that are familiar with medications and interacting with patients and doctors and things of that nature. So yes, um, a lot of nurses do end up being clinical study coordinators. And so that's a direct path in. Now you don't have to take that path, but yeah, if you wanted to do nursing and then wanted to do clinical research, or maybe you could even do both at the same time. I know nurses that do that. Um, you can definitely do that. So there are options like that. Um, and it's definitely something to consider. Now that's, that's what I would basically say on that. Um, now you don't need to major in any science to be in clinical research. You can major in whatever you want to major in business, economics, history, and get in clinical research. Um, the only thing that's easier is if you have a science degree and you can get some kind of internship experience in clinical research. Um, that would really set you up to be in clinical research is get some kind of internship, either at a pharmaceutical company, um, either at a CRO, either at the site level. Um, that's what you really want to focus on, less so much in what degree you're getting, but more so the experience you're getting. And that's the lens I used to uh, decide to give my take on this answer is because that nursing experience is different. That nursing experience is valuable for clinical research at the site level. So that's kind of what you want to think about, is what kind of experience are you going to be able to get. You could also do the same type of thing with your biology degree. Go get, you know, work on your biology degree and go work for a pharmaceutical company as an intern or, you know, a paid job if you can um, in clinical research. 
And then that's going to set you up uh, even more so than the nursing credentials if you want to get, if you know for sure you want to get into clinical research, is go get actual clinical research experience. So that's what I would do. If you knew you're getting into clinical research, just go, just go straight to the horse's mouth. Go get the clinical research experience, and that's going to set you up further than go being a nurse, go get nursing experience, and then try and parlay that into clinical research experience, and then parlay that into whatever role you're trying to get to in the future, whether it's CRA, project manager, you know, executive, whatever. Uh, I would just go straight for the clinical research experience because then you'll be able to get a clinical research job for sure after you graduate college. Um, and that's how I would think about it. So hope this was helpful, guys. Um, email me, eliteclinicalgroup at gmail.com for your questions. Take care.